This is Jim Smith of Golden Real Estate. Today I'm showing you 28966 Clover Lane in High Wan Hills in, in Evergreen. This house is nestled in a very quiet part of the neighborhood and has a driveway down there to a two-car garage and a carport, but it also has additional guest parking up here where the road is extra wide. You enter from there, you can enter by going down these stairs, down to the house, or you can drive down to the guest area and park there. Coming down the walkway here, here's the front porch, and we enter there. Coming in through the front door, you're on a landing, go up half a flight to the main floor or down half a flight to the lower level. Here's the main floor. Look at this nice vaulted cedar ceiling here. And the hardwood floor. Really nice, almost call this a great room. I don't call many rooms great rooms, but when they have vaulted ceilings like this and a fireplace, I tend to call them a great room. Here's the kitchen. Kitchen has a tile counter, wood trimmed. Electric cooked up with uh, double ovens over there. Trash compactor, dishwasher. Look at the view of, from your kitchen sink of the mountains. Same view is available from the eat-in kitchen, the eating area of the kitchen. Let's just take a moment and look at it. Afternoon sun makes it a little hard to see, but if I zoom in, you can see some of the mountains around Evergreen here. Coming back in, here's the, another view of the kitchen. The formal dining room is right here. Nice uh, granite countertop here with the, uh, with the mirror. Lots of closet space. There's the powder room right there. And that's that's the main floor. Let's, uh, before I go upstairs to the master suite, let's look at the deck, which is outside the great room. Spacious deck. About 15 by 25, I'm guessing. Looking out over the woods and that view of the mountains. Let's go upstairs now and look at the master suite. Go up here. At the top of the stairs now, this opens right into the master suite. And for privacy, there's this accordion door that you can close like this. Two steps down, I love this little cutout here. It's a view of the great room from up here. So, continuing with the master suite, here is the master bath with an extra wide tiled shower and two sinks, a toilet. Look out. That's a hundred year old tree, by the way. Then Notice the view from the master bedroom. It's even better than downstairs, of course, because you're elevated. Nice, spacious walk-in closet with more shelves than you can reach without a step stool. So that's the master bedroom. Let's uh, go down now and look at the guest bedrooms, which are on the lower level. We're on the lower level now, a half flight down from the front door. Here's the laundry room just off of this second family room with another wood-burning fireplace and a patio or a deck. Actually it's a deck because it's a built over the ground and it's wood. Very nice. Again you're really in the woods here. This, is, this fenced area is a place where they grow stuff they don't want the deer or elk to eat. 
Coming back in through the door. Here are the two guest bedrooms. One here with closet there and shelf up there. You'll see that same design in this room because it has the same vaulted ceilings. Here's the other guest bedroom looking out over that gardening area. And there's the shelf up there. And here, look at this shelving in this uh, walk-in closet here. And over here, the shoe shelving up there. Very nice. Now, these bedrooms are served, well, that's a linen closet, by this bathroom, which has two sinks, see? And a toilet and a tub shower. This room right here, is a storage room. Lots of useful shelving there. And it's actually accessed from that laundry room that I started out showing you. And that's under stair storage there. But here we are coming out into that family room again. Here is the garage. Spacious garage. Oversized garage. You notice there's room over there for there, snow blower and trash cans. Some shelving here. And let's go out here and look at the driveway and carport. There's the driveway coming down from Clover Lane. Here's a carport underneath that deck. That's the deck outside the great room that I was showing you. And here's guest parking over here. That's it. Now let's go out front and wrap it up. Thanks for touring this fine Haiwan Hills home with me this afternoon. If you'd like to see it in person, it would be my pleasure to show it to you. You can reach me anytime on my cell phone at 303 525-1851 or you can email me at jim at goldenrealestate.com Thanks for watching. Have a great day.